It all started here, right here. In the beginning was the word. <laughs> Um, and it, when uh, I went to school uh, in Albany in, at school six, I went to school 20, I went to Hackett, I went to Albany High, I was an avid reader. I loved reading. I was, I was, I was a voracious reader. Uh, but it was To Kill a Mockingbird that changed everything for me because that was the first time I read something that had to do with me and us as African Americans and our place in society at the time. In seventh grade, I saw something that had to do with me. And uh, after that, I was often running to find any anything that would 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 explain me and talk about me and and I can't tell you how the school system the public school system in Albany is the reason why I stand here today Be Because when I went to school, we had an arts program that went for, that started in fourth grade. In fourth grade, they said, would you like to play an instrument? Which instrument? Any instrument. And we give you lessons. And then you join the choir, and then you, the, 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 the orchestra, and then you, 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 it was, it was, Complete immersion in the arts, but I was in a public school. I did chorus. I did uh, uh, drama. I did everything. There were art classes. I don't know how anyone is working now without these things, without this kind of support. Because in 10th grade, I ran into a teacher, John Veeley, and he ushered me in to the theater. We had classes that really only concentrated on the Greeks, only concentrated on, on Shakespeare, concentrated on the modern writers, O'Neill and uh, Tennessee Williams. This is what the city gave me. I, had perf I went to church. I had a church that my mother put me in front in that church so that every time I stood up, I was validated. Every time. There was not a time you could, she'd say, you're gonna play the violin um, Sunday. And there I would be, after two years of practice, playing a violin at, at my church. And they said, amen. <laughs> This city has done nothing but validate everything I've done all along the way. So that once I finished with, uh, with all of the theater that I did 10th, 11th, and 12th grade, there it was. I had no choice but to go to school and study what I had a passion for. A lot of people get out of school now and they don't know. They don't know what they're going to study. I think I'll take four years and I'll figure that out. But for me, because of the arts program from fourth grade to twelfth, I got out knowing that this is where I belong. I belong where I can be an actor, where I can be a performer, where I can stand in front of audiences and feel comfortable. And change them. We walk into the theater to be changed somehow. It's like church. We walk into church empty. We come out of church full. And that's what happens for me in the theater, whether I'm working in it or sitting there.